Yeah, we just passed uh, north of Philippines uh, this morning. There's a big separation uh, since uh, yesterday afternoon uh, with Brunil on Team SA. And, uh, no, it looks like uh, it could be a good uh, good move for them. And uh, it's a bit, uh, we are a bit nervous. <laughs> There was always an option to uh, play the north early and, and on our routing it looked like it could be uh, better. We've, we've however made the decision to stick with the, the pack now uh, is where you start to see the rewards of the northerly option. No, I have a new girlfriend. It's good to have a young girlfriend, you know. I'm sorry, but it was time for me to change. There's uh, less breeze when we go on the San Linto. You can see it already the last 24 hours. They've been uh, making substantial gains behind us, so uh, I think they have to come within a couple of miles of us until uh, we're in the same water, so it will be just coming all together again. <laughs> right, who hasn't crossed the equator? <laughs> Come on, swallow! <laughs> <laughs> oh. yeah, it's a good surprise, uh, 48 hours ago, I think maybe less than that, we were last boat. I think uh, everybody can win this leg uh, today. We are here, the fit will be, is very close. I think everybody must be in 10 miles. I guess it's not what everyone pictures as the doldrums, but the situation's been a little different. The, uh, the kicker is going to be though, in about 400 miles time, when we're out of the doldrums, we're going to get an area that's just like the doldrums. So, uh... <laughs>
well as, as you can imagine, very happy, me and the whole team. Uh, it's, it's a very good place to win, uh, to win a leg because uh, you, you can see how the, how the whole city lives the sailing, the sailing wall, and uh, I'm super happy. It's been a very tough leg, but, uh, but again, uh, happy and enjoying it.